This is the last video for this segment. Uh, I'm going to be demonstrating some of the uh, uh, LED headlights and fog lights and other miscellaneous lights that I have changed out. Um, I left the cabin lights and ground effects lights as the incandescent. I love that yellow glow of the incandescence. Um, gives more of an old school classy look on a vehicle. Um, I thought that was glass. That is just ice. Uh, though, and plus they're only on for a few seconds when you when you first start shut that off, maybe that'll help when you first turn on the vehicle or enter the vehicle and then they shut off, so the power draw from those is minimal that's 5, 10, 15, 20 25, 30, for maybe uh, 60 watts total when you on for a few seconds, negligible however, now the headlights are where the main problem came in because each of those was a 55 watt halogen and also fog lights were about uh, I think those were about 65 or 75 watts each uh, that drained the auxiliary battery extraordinarily quickly. Uh, what some people do is they use a DC to DC converter to step down the pack voltage down to the 12 volt voltage just to directly power the uh, auxiliary items on the car off the main pack voltage. I don't like that either because now you're reducing your range where uh, 10 pounds of additional batteries would give you a lot more uh, help you keep your normal range and give you all of your lights. As you, as you see, they can just turn it off. Um, I'm going to grab my keys here, pop my keys in. Of course, like I said, usually you got those little lights on when you get in, so you don't have to look at everything. Oh, her dash, everything came on. camera light off. Now these LEDs have two settings. They have just on and they have high beam. It's kind of hard to tell with this uh, camera here. And then let's turn on our, our fog lights. Close the door. Uh, nope, don't have those on. Well, headlights, they're actually quite a bit brighter than they look. These really light up the street quite, a, quite nicely. Um, I think my pack voltages are a little too low. In the previous video, I said I ran this thing down quite far. But, uh, they light up the street really nice. Oh, yeah, there we go. I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, I gotta let this thing charge up. So I'm gonna actually do another. I think I'll wait till tomorrow and do a uh, nighttime uh, video showing uh, operation of the 